Colorado Springs is located just southeast of the very heart of the state. We have an elevation on average of 6,035 feet. Our skyline is dominated by glacier carved Pikes Peak. Colorado Springs is the quintessential American city. Colorado Springs is, in my opinion, the most beautiful big city in America. Our landscape is defined by one of the most beautiful pieces of Earth on the entire globe. You can find some very small cities in mountain settings, but it's very unusual to find the 40th largest city in America with a natural, scenic environment like Colorado Springs has. You don't have to drive 45 minutes to get to the mountains. Most residents of Colorado Springs can walk or bike to the mountains in a matter of minutes. It's really uh, very unusual in that regard. There are numerous attractions and activities, from the Fine Arts Center to Cheyenne Mountain Zoo. There's a myriad of, of different outdoor activities to be involved with. You've got one of the most desirable environments uh, in the country, and frankly, people are starting to recognize that. There's so much fun to be found. It's time to explore Colorado Springs. When you think about the history of Colorado Springs, you start with the fact that Colorado Springs didn't happen by accident. A lot of cities, you know, they were trading posts and all of a sudden, you know, a city grew up there and the streets aren't very well designed and things like that. Colorado Springs is a whole different story. You have a, a railroad guy, uh, William Palmer, after the Civil War comes out here. Uh, everybody was developing uh, east-west railroads and he said, hey, I think I'm going to develop a north-south railroad from Cheyenne to Santa Fe and he's plotting it out and comes through this area and says oh my gosh this is the most beautiful place I'm gonna basically build a city here and he maps out a city wide streets brings in water to grow trees and in what had been a high desert you know plain creates a tree-filled oasis essentially and that's how we got started and it's always had that uh, kind of culture about it. We were a place that people loved to come and visit and that's still uh, the essence of our culture. People who live here choose it because of uh, the accessibility to all the recreational opportunities, our beautiful park system. I mean, you cannot beat our park system. Colorado Springs is a hub for lots of outdoor mountain region adventures. There's Garden of the Gods, featuring its iconic red sandstone formations and mountain views. Every other subdivision has access to a hiking trail or paths. And when we first got here, it was every day we would drive through Garden of the Gods. For as many times as we drove through there, you would think we, we would get tired of it, right? You know, but you just, um, you just don't. It's not something that you see everywhere and anywhere. There's a lot of things as far as the outdoor activities and people that are vested and passionate about outdoor activities that make Colorado Springs a great place. First of all, I love Colorado Springs um, because it's very outdoorsy. Well, of course, everybody says the outdoors. I definitely love the outdoors. It's such an easy access to, to do hiking. Kayaking. Fly fishing. Biking. Rock climbing. Climb the incline. Within like 10 miles, like even within town, there's plenty of beautiful hikes with beautiful city views. I mean, if you're an avid sports person, you're going to get your fill of extreme sports here. Angler's Covey is one of the largest fly shops in the country, and we specialize in this local region in Colorado Springs. We have two major rivers, the South Platte and the Arkansas River, plus a whole host of lakes and so forth. Matter of fact, Colorado has 9,000 miles of fishable water and 2,000 lakes. That drive up to Helen Hunt Falls oh my is spectacular. Yeah. It is the most gorgeous thing. I'm really close to um, Helen Hunt Falls and the whole Cheyenne Canyon. 
And so our zoo is amazing. Colorado Springs is also a top destination for animal lovers. The Cheyenne Mountain Zoo is located southwest of downtown Colorado Springs. At an elevation over 6,000 feet above sea level, it is the highest zoo in America. It's also named the fourth best zoo in the nation in 2018. However, in the springs, you don't have to go far from your front door to experience the great outdoors. Western residents regularly have mule deer and elk visitors pass by their front yards and neighborhood streets. Being located right in the shadow of Pikes Peak, all kinds of mountainous wildlife call this city home. I grew up next to North Cheyenne Canyon Park. I live now close to Bear Creek Regional Park. And I spend a lot of time uh, in those parks just soaking in the change of seasons, uh, the wildlife. Uh, it's just a, a tremendous place to, to be. There's not really a lot of cities like that where you can go and not, you can go in city limits and still enjoy some amazing things for, for and it takes you out of the city. Yeah. I mean, you lose track of the, yeah. the fact that you're in the city now. Yeah. It just takes you right into the wilderness. And there's Pikes Peak right there that has like amazing views. It's free and it's within city limits. I mean, right. it's not even like you have to drive an hour. The weather is super appealing to people. We've got some great rivers for rafting and um, great hiking year round. Number one, what I love about Carroll Springs is just the amount of blue sky and the sunshine. One of the things that surprises people is they think, oh, we have snow all the time. The fact of the matter is we can have a two foot snow and it's melted off in 48 hours. The sky is always doing something picturesque. There's all these beautiful mountains and land formations. I think we have a lot more distracted drivers because there's always something to look at. Think about the song Amer America the Beautiful and the majestic mountains yeah. are in Colorado Springs. Yeah. You have the Rocky Mountains right there at your doorstep. Why wouldn't you want to be in a place where the sun shines so much? It's time to celebrate. There's so much fun to be found, from the Division I hockey team at Colorado College and the Switchbacks professional soccer team, to the Division I basketball team of the Air Force Falcons, sports fans and athletes alike will be more than satisfied with the amount of high-level performing teams in the region. Our amazing city is home to literally dozens of eclectic and locally owned places throughout. There's something here for just about every preference. Let's have a look. My name is Suzette McGarry. I'm the co-owner, along with my husband Kevin, of the Skirted Heifer and Bambino's Urban Pizzeria in downtown Colorado Springs. The Skirted Heifer is a burger and fry and frozen custard restaurant in downtown Colorado Springs. Right away, we realized that um, People were appreciating all of our effort that went into our burger. I really feel like there is a absolute pointed interest in growing local business and supporting local business. The culture of Colorado Springs is very relaxed but youthful. The, the downtown life is, is very active. There's lots of places to go, a lot of things to do. Downtown Colorado Springs is super special. The shopping, the activity, the restaurants, um, it, it's just a thriving place to be. There's lots of local breweries you can go and make new friends. A bunch of craft beers. Um, one of the things I'd say that's really important to Axe in the Oak is a sense of community, bringing people together to share life and share experience. Most of the ways that I met my friends here in town was through different groups, just getting together on common interests. There is a pointed and kind of a vested interest from the community to the business to, to grow and be a part of something that you know, may or may not be sort of mainstream. Owning a business in Colorado Springs is great just because the place, you want to always work where you want to live. I mean, 
this is a uh, this is a place to, to attract talent, uh, young people. It's a great place to raise a family. Um, it's uh, you combine that quality of life and economic opportunity, and it's hard to beat Colorado Springs. The Colorado Springs Conservatory is a complete arts immersion program for children ages two months through 18, and then we have an incredible amount of community and adult classes that we offer in addition to that. We are uh, an area with a uh, well-educated population. In Colorado Springs, higher education is of the utmost importance, and UCCS is an excellent representative of that fact. The University of Colorado at Colorado Springs is part of the state's university system. As of fall 2017, UCCS has over 12,400 undergraduate and 1,822 graduate students. UCCS offers 46 bachelor's degrees, 22 masters, and five doctoral degree programs. It is also home to a nationally ranked engineering program and ranks 51st overall in the nation. There is no doubting that UCCS is a popular, innovative, and fast-growing place for higher learning. Our strengths are areas like aerospace, cybersecurity, uh, medical innovation. At Springs Integrated Health, we're a physical medicine office, so we provide medical services, chiropractic services, and we are all actually, as well, a fully functioning lab. Colorado Springs as a city is just a great place um, to start a business, grow a business. I think there's a developing culture for entrepreneurship. Not only do you have a desirable place to live, but you've got a booming economy. Uh, our unemployment rate's 2.5 percent, you know, about 2 percent below the national average. Uh, we've got functional full employment. The uh, job openings we've got have an average salary of $67,500. That's really good. For some of you, you're thinking about buying a home for the very first time. For others, your family is growing or you just got happily married. It's time to own your dream home. We looked at houses, found a house, and over the course of the next several years, we lived in this one house in town and then we needed to downsize because all of our kids moved out. And so we talked with Jose and Van Tijic, and uh, he helped us to sell our house. And in the same process, he helped us to buy a new house. Every home sale transaction is unique. Every person is unique. Every family is unique. And they're all going to have different needs. It's all going to run into different hurdles. You just don't give up. We don't give up on the transaction, we don't give up on the people. Every person has different needs when it comes to their financial profile, and every person has a different family, and every person has a different way to communicate. And the trick with that is you just don't give up on each other. They really made the process seamless and easy. And if you're somebody who doesn't want to have to worry about the little details and always having to worry about things, Vantagic made it easy. Maybe life's changes are driving you to the springs possibly a military PCS, or your career is transferring you to a new city. Back when I was in college, I did two summers down in West Cliff, Colorado, and on a couple of the occasions I'd get some time off, I came out to Colorado Springs. Always thought it was a beautiful city then, I still think it's a beautiful city, and so when I got the opportunity with the Missile Defense Agency to move to Colorado Springs from California, I, I took that opportunity. The Pikes Peak region has long been home to large military installations. El Paso County is unique as the only county in the nation that is home to five military commands. Fort Carson, United States Air Force Academy, Peterson Air Force Base, Schriever Air Force Base, and Cheyenne Mountain. Here in Colorado Springs, we're surrounded by Fort Carson, Schriever, Peterson, Cheyenne Mountain Air Force Station. And uh, this is probably one of the most military friendly communities I've, I've experienced in my, in my life, you know, uh, compared to some of the other places I've been to. It really is 
a lot of people are sincere about that here. We definitely have a melting pot of a community in Colorado Springs. We've got several military bases and a lot of them choose to come back during retirement. Fort Carson is a family base, bringing more than 13,800 residents. Peterson Air Force Base hosts the world famous NORAD Command for Cheyenne Mountain, while Schriever is known for their defense and GPS programs. And our renowned Air Force Academy hosts not only the Air Force Falcons, but is also home to the Thunderbirds, our specialty aerial performers. 30% of the military personnel who are ever stationed here choose it as a place to retire. With the military, you know, the Air Force Base and the Air Force Academy and the Army Base, mm -hmm. you can meet people from all over the country, all walks of life. Believe it or not, like a lot of the people that we meet here aren't even from Colorado themselves. And it seems like they're all wanting the same thing, that ease and, and just, you know, just a more relaxed pace where they're able to enjoy life and really take it all in. Your home is more than just the four walls you live in. It determines where your children go to school, who they make friends with, who your neighbors will be, who will become your friends, and who will then become your support network. It even determines how long or short your commute to the office will be. It's home. It's time to live your dream. When I tell the story of this city, Colorado Springs, I tell a story of diversity, of incredible energy. You know, Colorado Springs has a lot to offer um, as it goes for a family. And now our kids are, are grown, but if I had younger children, this would definitely be a place um, that, that I would um, consider coming to. freedom my kids have here to grow and learn and just have new experiences. Um, there are so many, many things for kids. There's just tons of parks, uh, tons of um, things for all ages. Our kids grow up in a safe environment. The schools are wonderful. I love that we have the option of picking the schools that we want our child to go, our children to go to. Colorado Springs is a no-brainer. It's the best place to live, play, have fun, and create a life. A family should come to Colorado Springs if they are ready just to live their life. As a young person looking for opportunity, you're interested in quality of life, beautiful scenery, economic opportunity, there is no place better to move than Colorado Springs.